and she's the first lady to be elected to this position. Now I want to talk a bit about the history of the India-EU summits. The now, there have been 15 summits in the last 20 years. The first summit was held at Lisbon in Portugal in uh, the year 2000. That's 20 years ago. And the last summit was held in India in the year 2017. Now, if you're wondering what was on the agenda of those talks, well, here they are. Agenda item number one, India-EU strategic partnership. It involves trade and investment, security, climate and digital economy. Agenda item number two is the COVID-19 pandemic. They talked about global cooperation between India and the EU. The reform of the WHO in particular, preparedness and response. And last but not the least, research and development on a vaccine for COVID-19. All right, agenda item number three is multilateralism. It involves the UN agencies, involves the WTO as well. And remember, India has become a non-permanent member of the UNSC in the years 2021 and 2022. And also, India will host the G20 summit in the year 2022, the year India turns 75. All right, agenda item number four, global issues involving the Indo-Pacific and other issues. Now, one of the outcomes from the summit was the adoption of uh, an article looking ahead at the next five years. That's called the EU-India Strategic Partnership, a roadmap to 2025. Now take a look at how the relations have developed over the several decades. Let's look at the road travel. Now the ties began in the early 1960s with the European Economic Community way back in 1962. Then came the joint political statement in the year 1993 and the cooperation pact in 1994. And then came the strategic partnership agreement signed in the year 2004 and then the agenda for action 2020 adopted in 2016. Now, there are 31 dialogue mechanisms in this uh, relationship, and the EU adopted the New India Strategy in the year 2018. And then came the Joint Statement on Climate Change in the year 2017, the Declaration on Urbanization also in 2017, and also the same year, a Joint Statement on Terrorism. And then we had the two visits by the two foreign ministers of India and the EU this year in January and February. And finally, some data on bilateral trade now. Now, 2019, EU was India's largest trading partner by volume. The trade volume was $87 billion. And EU is the largest source of FTI into India. Now, talks on FTA began in 2007. It's called the Broad-Based Trade and Investment Agreement. But no progress was made since the year 2013.